Okay, so the other day, the kids and I were getting ready to run some errands, and they both came to me with these cute little looks on their faces, and in unison they said, Mommy, if we're good, can we get some ice cream? Well, to be honest, they got their love for ice cream from me, and I was definitely planning on stopping for ice cream, but I did not want them to think that it was a bribe. Please don't bribe your kids. No, no, you do not get ice cream if you're good. You be good no matter what. <laughs> so immediately it just hit me, this was a great opportunity to make sure that they understand that's not the way we work. And so I said, what does Ephesians 6, 1 say? Children, and then in unison they finished the verse. Obey your parents in the Lord for this is right. It does not say, children, obey your parents in the Lord for ice cream. And of course, they both laughed and thought that was hilarious. Um, and they know that verse not because they're super amazing, spiritual, holy, awesome kids, even though they're pretty great. From the time they were two, I started teaching them scripture that they could memorize and use and hide in their hearts that they might not sin against God. It's not that hard. It just takes repetition. Any kid can do this. I promise promise. They remember what they see frequently. How many times have they quoted things on silly shows and sung these crazy songs at little bitty ages, right? So let the Word of God be some of that stuff that they hear over and over and over again. So the point of this story is, I sat down, I talked to them, and listen, you don't get ice cream if you obey. You obey because you love God. And when I asked them, what is your number one job? What is your most important job? They both know the answer to that is to obey because that's something that we've talked about over and over again. And I tell them, the scripture says, God said, if you love me, you will obey me. You will keep my commandments. So you obey and you do what's right because that's the job God gave you. And because that shows love to God, it shows love to mommy and daddy, and it shows respect. And that's your most important job. That's why you obey, out of your heart and out of love. Ice cream, it's a special treat, and I will give it on the times that I feel like, hey, it's a great time to do a little extra something special and get some ice cream. On the flip side of that, you will not get ice cream if you disobey. The reason for that being, another thing that we repeat a lot, you cannot make bad decisions and expect good things to happen. So I've given you several little snippets here of things that we often say in our home. I think it's important to come up with these phrases that are easy to remember and that as soon as you start them, the kids can automatically quote them back to you. Really quick, easy things. And these things came to me just from a lot of time of prayer and spending time with the Lord. And like I said before in Isaiah, I love that scripture where it says, he gently leads those who have their young. It's amazing. He does. He will. Go to him. In James, it says, Anyone who acts wisdom, lacks wisdom, come and ask from God who gives liberally to all without reproach. He'll give it to you. I promise. Just stay close to him. Spend time with the Lord so that you hear that gentle whisper and he will gently lead you as you lead your babies. So, no, you don't know, do not obey for ice cream. You obey for the Lord, for this is right because you love God and because you know your job is to obey and it pleases him, and it shows love to mommy and daddy. Ice cream, definitely a plus. Definitely gonna happen frequently in my home because mommy loves ice cream too. But we obey for God, we obey for Jesus. And the feeling we get, I tell the kids a lot, the feeling you get from doing the right thing is an incredible feeling that you will never get from anything else that you do for yourself because only God can give you that feeling in your heart. And that's something we'll talk about more later. But I hope this helps. Um, children, obey your parents in the Lord for this is right. Not for ice cream, not for toys, not for privileges, but because it shows love to God. And that is your most important job. So until next time, bye.